I don't think I'm gonna make edibles no more. And I know people will be like, damn, that was uh short lived. But I everybody here in Detroit on some broke shit. So since everybody on some broke shit, I'm not gonna be wasting my time and energy and talents doing shit like that and end up with a bunch of edibles that don't nobody buy, so fuck it. It's like I'm gonna add it to my resume. My list of things that I'm good at and know I know how to do it. And if I do do it, I can see me doing it in the circumstances. Uh, I Like I go over to my auntie's, make her some edibles, leave them there. She give me the money. Don't give me the money. Then I take them with me. I do it like that. But I'm not going to make them here at this house and be stuck with the shit. So now, and the same with the weed. Niggas ain't buying weed. Everybody on some broke shit. And it's crazy because... Everybody got them stimulus checks. Everybody got their stimmy packs. You would think people got money, but no, nah, they ran through that shit like they was running uh, through the streets with their woes on some Drake shit. So no, nobody got no fucking money. I'm not going to keep uh, wasting my money on supplies and shit, on ingredients and shit I need to make this shit. And then y'all want to be on some broke shit. So I know how to do it. I successfully made them taste good and look good. So I perfected it. So we good. Like I said, I'm going to add that on top of massage therapy, on top of the shit I'm good at. And, you know, I, multiple sources of income. That's what I be on. So it's like, you know how to do this. You know how to do that. All my talents will still be relevant. And it will still be there for the people that want to come correct with their funds. Don't come correct. And, it, and I'm only charging $5 for the edibles, y'all. This is how bad motherfuckers be on some broke shit here in Detroit. They can't even manage $5. Like, okay, cool, 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 cool. So I ain't gonna do that shit again. And when it comes to the weed, now I'm just gonna buy enough weed for me to smoke. I'm not gonna buy enough for me to smoke and sell since y'all just too broke for either one. We good. And I told at least 10 people. So out of them 10 people, zero people bought any edibles from me. So that's unacceptable. Now, in 2016, I was selling brownies, but I had access to a car. So with the car, I sell all my fucking brownies. Without the car, we got a problem. 